Hello everyone, my name is Om Saga Song. In this video, I will talk about how to use Snackbar in Android Studio 2017. So Snackbar is a form of message that you can see at the bottom of your screen now. This is a simple the Snackbar and it is part of the material design from Android. So in this video, I will teach you how to do that. Okay, let's go to Android. Okay, let me create a project for that. So next and just use the version 4 and I will choose this because it will come with the snack bar okay it's very easy and then finish okay before we do anything just uh, run it and let's see the snack bar okay uh, this is the, just the sample code of the basic application when you click that you can see the snack bar over here so let's go to the Android code so the code for the snack bar is here but in this video we will try to create our own snack bar this is just a default come with the template and before we can do that let me go to google and help you with that just just type snack bar android and click on the second link you will come to the library of the snack bar and you have to understand the make method here when you click there, the first parameter is not like in tools or a lot of dialogue. Uh, usually, you just use the context. Here, you have to use the coordinate layout, which is very different from the tools and a lot of dialogue. So you would expect like put the this at the first parameter, and it should work, but it doesn't work. So you have to understand that. But before I write the code, I like to explain a little bit what is going on with the layout. You can see there are two layout files now. So the first activity is the, the one that holds the button and the snack bar over here. Okay, and the content main is something that you can put in, in here. So what you have to do is to go to activity main and you can see that here, coordinator layout. Okay, so without this layout, you cannot use a snack bar because it will appear on the button of the layout so it should work with the coordinator and if you did not import a correct gradle this one the design this one if you don't see this line you have to add it or you cannot use the snack bar okay so this is the first thing that you have to check and the second one is the file activity main and the coordinator layout so you can go to text and see what's going on here and the uh, first thing that you need is the is the ID of the coordinator layout okay so let me enter here Android and ID so you have to give an ID for that okay you can write the ID here just code layout okay or you can do that from the interface as well and you can do from the design as well you just click on the coordinator layout here and then you can see the property but you make sure you click on the coordinator first okay and give the layout maybe code layout again okay and you can go back to text and you can see the layout here okay so first you need that and now you are free to use any snack bar anywhere so let me create a button so go to the content main just add a button somewhere and now because I use constraint I have to click on this button to make the constraint to the left and to the top and maybe just give a name like ok ok and, and now you go to the main activity and you want to open the snack bar so first let me get the button from the layout so find you by id by id okay and then you need the coordinator layout okay coordinator layout and then just call code layout and the same so the same to the other component you need to find you by id or dot id dot bit and uh, dot code layout okay and now you can use the button click set on click listener 
then new control space okay and now you can call select bar make and code layout okay and you have to put the final because now you are using in the inner class of the um, even click and if you want to use it in somewhere else you should do like this declare outside here and just delete the final and code layout like this okay now you can use anywhere and then second one is the message and are you ready to use next bar okay. and then the length will be long and show so uh, the same to the tool so run it okay let's click on the button see that this is the message okay so let me summarize that the first thing that you need to do is the gradle here this line usually you don't have to do anything because the new version of android studio will come with a design and the second one in the activity main the, the id of the coordinator layout and now you can use the snake bar over here anywhere you want okay that's it for this video thank you for watching if you have any questions just comment down below don't forget to subscribe to this channel thank you and i will see you in the next video